measures in the contain 60 cm of oil at 0 degrees celsius 60 cubic centimeters of oil at zero degrees celsius when a piece of ice was dropped uh, dropped into the cylinder it sank completely in the oil and oil level rose to 90 mark when the ice melted the oil level became down to 87 cubic centimeters mark the relative density is of ice is right i don't know uh, why did you make this so difficult it's not difficult actually I mean, lots of you have made this very difficult, but it's not difficult. You just have to draw a few diagrams and just uh, think about it, right? So, uh. Initial level 60. Initial level is 60. Then once you put ice, once you put ice, it goes to 90. What you have is ice. Then all the ice is melted. It goes to 87. Let's take the density of this oil. you know now when the ice is melted what you get is water so in this system what you have is water plus ice right I mean think about this if you think about this it's not difficult to understand so initially you had 60 cubic centimeters of oil now you have 87 cubic centimeters of water and sorry oil and ice sorry water and oil right sorry it's water and oil so what's the volume of water volume of water as you know that's 87 minus 60 so it's 27 cubic centimeters of water right it's 27 cubic centimeters of water is what you get okay and you know this is floating that's floating so when it's floating it floats because the upthrust is equal to the mg you have an upthrust the upthrust is equal to mg so upthrust also is known as the weight of the displaced liquid weight of the displaced liquid so the displaced liquid volume is 30 displaced ice volume uh, oil volume is 30 so how do we get an equation from this that's the problem how do you get an equation of this and they don't ask us to find uh, anything else but relative density of ice is what they want us to find Relative density of ice so first we need to find out what is the volume of ice. What's the volume of ice? How do we fuse this to find the volume of ice? How do you do that? Let's think about it. Now what I know is... Uh, sorry. I actually missed something. It sank completely into the oil and oil level rose. It sank completely. This I missed. 
That's a very crucial point. So it, it, it goes down in the oil completely. So what's the volume of ice then? Thirty cubic centimeters. Yes, now it's ninety. Before it was sixty, so it's thirty cubic centimeters. Now we know there was some ice. Then it became water. It's the same mass of ice and water. Volume thirty and. 27 relative density of ice how do you get it density of ice divided by density of water how do you get density of ice mass of ice divided by volume of ice divided by mass of water divided by volume of water what you get point nine. It's that easy. 